say. Uh, so Super and Bows, Bros, I know they're very solid. They usually partner and they're both of those players are fairly solid. Flying Llamas are pretty good. Their game plan approaching doubles is... Uh, is pretty good. With, I'm guessing Wario kind of just waiting around for a walk and just riding out a bike every once in a while. Bro, we were taking uh, CPU's stock with boost kick. His CSS is good at that. I just got to get my Mario uh, in this game is a fairly solid character. He's a lot better than any of the other games he's been in. His moves are fast and his smashes are particularly fast actually, but uh, you have to kinda he doesn't have any kill subs, so you kinda have to get with the read for him to kill, so he does have some difficulties killing. That's the overall is back here will take Robear stock. Uh, Ness is a very solid character in this game. A boost kick will take that stock too. Wario kind of has always just been Wario, I guess. Solid character, has a gimmick, used the gimmick in certain situations. Seems to be Wario still. CP and I cover Super Fire and Ari Bros just destroyed CPU there by removing all the stocks almost right away actually. Well not right away, but he didn't feel it there right Victory looking almost in Funari Bros favor, although 2v1 comebacks like this have happened before. It's not likely. True and Bro Bear Team Tech. Uh True and Bro Bear doing well in this 2v1 situation. A lot of people, a lot of teams here actually don't seem to practice to be one situations all too often. <laughs> and we're often not, not quite sure what to do. And with that, Super Fury and Ari Bros will take the first game instead of best of three. <laughs>
Purple. Uh, so it looks like they're going to PK stand, but character, character picking. Maybe. So we're going game watch and Kuro going Mewtwo. I don't really know much about what they do when they play these characters particularly. <laughs> Yourself? Yeah. I'm hopping on. Alright. Thank you, because I don't really have a whole lot to say about things. Alright, hey, this is Nine Pills hopping on commentary with Zeno. So, uh, tell me about the match we got going on right now. Uh, so Super Spinner Night Bros. is off the game. Uh, actually switched from CSS and Mario to well, Game Watch and V2. So basically, they won the first set on their mains, and then they, feeling comfortable, decided to go up to their seconds. Yeah. Um, I was, they don't actually play these characters as singles much, but they love using these characters as their doubles team. We're playing these as winners and stuff. Um, and... So, uh, one thing that they like to do is they like to do that uh, bucket shadow ball combo. I, I think that's what they're doing, but I, was, I didn't say anything. That's probably like the inspiration for the for their team to begin with, but they've come probably. up with some other things they like to do since then. Wow, Ness just got caught in that up smash. Nice up smash by Kira there. One of the things um, I've heard Jax talk about before is a uh, weakness of Ness's is that since there's no uh, second double jump canceling with yeah. moves in this game, he has to go for the full hop, and that's it. that's how Kira took advantage of there. I saw Ness go for that full hop, and he did an up smash to catch him out of it. Back throw with okay. Kira. Game four throw? throw? That was four throw. That was four throw. That looked like back throw. Uh, little take. Game watch his stock. That, that was kind of rock throw, I guess. Can you win the computer at Melee HP 2 1? Yeah. Melee HP 1. Yeah. Alright, well, we're on the. We're going back to the standard transition here. Oh, we got that bucket hit! Sorry, I'm not, I wasn't able to totally pay attention to the full match there, but. Um, oh, but it looks like Broker had a self destruct of some sort. Um, and Wario over there is sitting on a full waft part. With rage. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, with the rage, so... That, that that's something green team's definitely gonna be aware of. Early. Actually, you know what's interesting? It looks like uh, we've got two stock tankers. Churro, as per usual, is somehow maintaining all three of his stocks, even though he's, like, the second latest character in the game. In fact, Churro has... Wow. And then, on the other hand, uh, Ness and Brobear were are losing all their stocks, but it looks like yeah. um, Wario finally lost some of his. And there's the bucket again. Only it was uh, acting as a, as a yeah, as a friendly fire bucket. Uh, that's that's what friends are for, right? Yeah. Wario just riding through PK Stadium on his bike. Yeah, um, so do you know a whole lot about this, uh, the Flying Llamas? Do they not know No, I don't actually. They know it, but they aren't doing it right now. I'm sure they know it, though. I've seen him do down throw to hammer and stuff, so. Down throw to bucket, that's Yep. There's the bucket, right as Wario came into it. And that was both the enemies, actually. Ness was in that, too. <laughs> and Churro totally saw that waft coming. Wario uh, trying for that raw waft there. Yeah. That would have no anvil. It would have, but it didn't, because Churro saw it coming. <laughs> And another friendly fire bucket, but that one is going to take off the last stock on the flying levels as well. So it looks like uh, the Furunari Bros secondary team worked for them just as well as their first team. Although I did not see that happen. But Alright, I'm going to be stepping off and I'm going to be getting 